County Sheriff is promising a thorough and transparent investigation into the shooting death of a 13 year old boy. Family and friends today mourning the death of Andy Lopez. He was shot and killed by deputies. You're watching the most shocking and informative LRJ TV news. We're learning new details tonight from the spokesperson for the Santa Rosa PD. A press conference just wrapped up in that building in the last 45 minutes. Lieutenant Paul Henry, he says deputies say they saw the subject, 13 year old Andy Lopez, carrying what they thought was an assault style weapon around 315 yesterday afternoon. So this happened in South Santa Rosa. Deputies in marked patrol cars and in uniforms say they told the victim two times, two times to put down the gun. At the time, Lopez's back was turned away from the deputies, according to PD's spokesperson. And according to the deputies, Lopez turned around with the gun's barrel turning toward the deputies. Well, that's when one deputy fired several rounds and one hit and killed Lopez. The spokesperson says deputies took measures to try and save Lopez's life, but it was too late. And turns out what the deputies thought was an assault, an assault rifle was nothing but a replica. The deputy feared for his safety, the safety of his partner, and the safety of the community members in the area. He believed the subject was going to shoot him or his partner. So at today's press conference, they also showed us side by side a comparison between a real AK-47 and a replica AK-47. We also spoke with the victim's family earlier today. Of course, they're absolutely heartbroken over all of this. Uh, Alan, back to you. Question, Mark. You talked to, to the family. This thing about the right. dad having, having rules about the guns, what was that all about? The victim's father did say that his son did like playing with toy guns, but the rule was, you know, play with those toy guns in the house. He typically would not play with them outside the house. But according to the father, the victim was taking the gun to a neighbor's house to return it. It was not the victim's replica gun. It was his friends. It was his neighbor's, Alan. Right. I'm LRJ. Rate, comment, and subscribe because you, like you did. I love you all. Peace.